How big of a game is this Saturday's game against Wolves? Good afternoon. Again, we are going to play at home and with our supporters, and it's the same, the same objective at the beginning is to win. Uh, but above all, before to win, I think uh, we need to, with uh, that 90 minutes on the, on the game to connect with our supporters. I think it's, it's very important to do that. I want to ask you about Granit Xhaka. How has how's he been this week? He's training with uh, a normality with, with, with the team. He didn't play on uh, on Liverpool and and is uh, for me is uh, continuing above all focusing the match tomorrow. I think uh, Granit Xhaka has been very Sometimes people can forget that footballers are human beings. How much is it about now, I suppose, protecting uh, Granit Xhaka, looking after him to make sure that he is okay? Yes, the first is uh, the person and uh, the human, like uh, everyone, uh, feel and. Shaka's issues uh, last week is one issue, need time to recover the normality in him and for us. Are you surprised now that how explosive the abuse is that footballers have to deal with on social media, from fans, in the stadiums? Abuse that's not just directed at them, but at their families as well. <laughs> Everybody, maybe we have uh, some on uh, social media, in, in, our, in our phone, in, uh, in our internet, in our web. But uh, really, uh, to use uh, it, I think, uh, is, uh, is only being intelligent. And also, we can, we can respect the people on social media, but also we, we, we have to, to separate how much is reality, real or is... is, is is uh, transmitting every every supporters uh, they are or not following that. For me, the the best the best the best supporters or oh, the the good response is how the supporters uh, respond in our stadium. We have a lot of supporters around the world, and we respect them, but the, the real response is in, in, in the stadium. And in the stadium, sometimes the people, is normal when we are not winning, they are responding uh, some, with some criticism. It's normal to the coach, to the players, but also a lot of players sometimes receive that criticism in the stadium, and then when you recover or you come back with again with a, a good performance, they forgot that, and also they applaud the players and applaud the team. And this is our objective. But our objective is now is to model uh, that match to win, connect with the people to win, and the respond the supporters to us, uh, helping us in 90 minutes. This is our target tomorrow. But, but how do the players connect with the fans, like you say? Uh, the connect is uh, to use our quality, to use our energy, to use playing our capacity to, to break their, their game plan and in 90 minutes uh, be intense, be intense and be clear with uh, our, 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 our skills. Our, but also we know it very much is, is difficult, but I can't remember this year we didn't lose at the moment at, in at home. Uh, I think we are, we are feeling strong. We are winning not with a big result against the opposition, but we are winning more than we, we, we draw two matches, but uh, we, we won another matches. And really, uh, last year we, we felt very strong with our support in the Emirates. And this year we are starting not with the same uh, strong, strong, uh, uh, strong transmission uh, to our support. We are, we are really with confidence, we are really imposing every time our, our, our game plan, but we are going to do. I am, I am very conf, conf, believable or, or confident with, with uh, our work in, in this, in this uh, process, and, and I think we are going to do. And tomorrow is a, a good opportunity, a good, as the first opportunity after the last matches to, 
to show and the objective is the three points, but also is for me is to play well. Do you think there's any way now that Granit Xhaka can redeem himself in the eyes of the fans. Okay, I want to finish with that, okay? Uh, he said uh, sorry, he gave the apologies with, to the supporters, with, to everybody, and now is the focus to move the match. And what are you expecting from Wolves tomorrow? Uh, A team that's very good uh, against the top six clubs. Really, <laughs> they are a very strong team. Uh, they struck to defensively was was uh, was uh, strong, was hard, and uh, last year we draw here, we draw here against them, and uh, the transition is amazing transition with very uh, that's a structure is to play a ball ball uh, with that transition and then when they they can play they can build up they can also use the 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 quality players they use. It's going to be a very difficult match and it's a challenge, but uh, we are preparing, we are working for, for to, to improve our, our things and uh, I am looking forward to see our team tomorrow and uh, our respond against them with our support in the modern Emirates. Okay. I, I, I know you've talked a lot about Granit, but could you just clarify, is he still captain? He did a, a, a step. We, we were waiting uh, on Monday on, on the last con press conference here on Tuesday. And the next step is to model the match. Uh, the focus is to model the match. It's not in, in my mind he will play tomorrow. It's not in my mind he is going to play tomorrow. It's not in my mind it's not in my mind he is going to play tomorrow. It's not in my mind. Uh, I, okay. I am thinking tomorrow he's not going to play. Okay. And it, is that because of the, the circumstances? Because I think that uh, now uh, we need also to be focused only, only 100% on the match. And, and I think uh, now uh, we are going to do today the training, but uh, at the moment it's not in my mind. So you, is that so you concerned though that the talk around Granite could be a distraction for the team. Uh, tomorrow I want to speak about the other players they are going to play. Okay. Thank you. Um, obviously it's been a tough couple of games this past week, losing the two goal leads. Can you pinpoint why you think that is? Is there a commonality? Both teams <coughs> starting at 2-0 and then losing those leads. Yes, yeah, the circumstances uh, happen at uh, and different moment on, on 90 minutes uh, change the match. Uh, we are working also for, for to improve uh, defensively, offensively. Uh, when we are winning Chunil, it's not normal to, to draw. Um, we deserve it to win, but okay, and then we, can, we can speak also about the, the referee's uh, decision uh, last, last week. But finish, finish it really that match, and we are going to, to focus it tomorrow and improving. And uh, uh, now it's different team. Uh, also, they have very good players. The, the structure is very strong, structure defensively. And how we, we are going to manage tomorrow, 90 minutes, imposing our, our game plan. This is, this is the, a new challenge for us, and, and also. Uh, I am excited to, to, to play tomorrow and I, if uh, you ask me you ask me uh, when do you want to play your matches at home at home with a supporter because I think we can feel uh, strong with them Wolves have only lost once on the road this season they obviously also beat Manchester City um, what can you learn from the way they play that will help you with the approach and what to expect from them yes they won in, in, in Manchester City's stadium and it's amazing, that's, that's the result. It's very difficult to win there. And then they lost uh, in Everton. They, they draw at the last minute in, in, in Crystal Palace. It depends each match. But uh, if you before are, are, are thinking uh, they are going to, to win in, in Manchester City, normally no, but they won. And we have the respect, but we have the respect that much how they played, also how they played in Crystal Palace, how they played last week uh, drawing in, 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 uh, in Newcastle. And now we, are, we want to, to write uh, our match, to write, to, to play, uh, preparing our match with, uh, with respecting them in 30% and, and imposing our idea in 70%. This is my, my idea each, each match and, and tomorrow the same. We are thinking and respecting them, but above all, uh, we need to create our 
our uh, strong structure also with the ball, with the possession, with our game plan and defensively, we know we need to stop them. And can you please speak about some of the players that played particularly well um, this week, midweek, Mesut Ozil obviously, uh, Martinelli, the other youngster? It's very important. Uh, play first. We are playing out of matches and we are using players. And for them also, it's a challenge each match to show how, how they are and how they can help uh, help us. And for me, it's very important also and it's positive uh, their their performance uh, on, th on on Thursday in in in, in on Wednesday so in Liverpool. And, and I am thinking also how they can help us tomorrow. Okay. Next few questions for 10:30 for um, for tonight. Thank you.